So I'm Jin Xin Li uh, from the Department of Nano Engineering, just one lab. Actually, uh, our lab specialty is combined robotics with material science and nanotechnology. There is a famous movie, Fantastic Voyage, probably like uh, 50 years ago. There's a uh, microscopic submarine that travels in your, in your human body and uh, treat life threatening conditions. That's, that's sort of a Hollywood production. But now our U.S. San Diego nanoengineering are really make this happening. So I think uh, building nanorobots to move in your body, I think it's a dream of our, our human beings that uh, also is, 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 is a new technology in medicine that would happen in coming decade. Our current research is mainly focusing on uh, nanorobotics, smart and intelligent, and for various functions. And mainly what we are focusing on now is biomedic applications. This is the first example that we put these rockets in your mouse stomach so they show efficient motion and also efficient uh, payload delivery and leaving nothing toxic behind. So I think this is a really exciting uh, time of nanorobotic development. And uh, I think uh, uh, in the future we are going to get a lot of more real world applications of this technology. And what I show here is that it could be like use your body fluid as fuel, it, it delivery payload, and the most important thing is that these materials are biodegradable. So they just destroy themselves and leave nothing toxic behind. The aim is use this technology for future biomedical applications, for example, uh, minimal invasive surgery and drug delivery. So nanorobots is really precise machines that could work on that scale and could give you medicine at very high precision. Yeah. I think this is a very big motivation for me to, 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 to achieve this goal because uh, currently we have a lot of, I mean, health problems and we cannot solve. I think the next step, what we are going to do, we are going to really uh, integrate a lot of different drugs inside the rockets and to test their efficiency to, to treat disease uh, in stomach or in some other tissue. And the ultimate goal definitely is to get a clin clinical application of this technology. Uh, I think uh, it takes maybe a couple of years to come, but I think uh, with luck, this nanorobotic technology will definitely uh, get their fantastic voyage in our human body.